Hey guys, I just wanted to make a video um, and uh, I don't know about what. Um, I do know about what, of course. Um, yeah, I just want to make a video about uh, life and um, people, uh, humans. Um, the way I look at the world, um, this has uh, been formed a lot by uh, the great late Julian L. Simon, who wrote the book, um, The Ultimate Resource. And um, what, what he learned me was that things are getting better over time for humanity and also for the planet uh, and for animals. Um, even though human population is expanding, um, this actually is a good thing. Um, it's in our own self-interest as an individual that there are more people. Uh, yeah, many people think that the more people there are, the lesser you will have, but it's actually the inverse. The more people there are, the more you will have. Because the more people there are, the, the better uh, we become at producing things. Uh, and so the cheaper it becomes uh, to produce something. And, and you see that um, whereas, let's say, I don't know how long ago, but many thousands of years, tens of thousands of years ago, or, or hundreds of thousands of years ago when we were living uh, much more primitive, we had to hunt uh, for food and um, uh, or, 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 um, or gather uh, uh, fruits uh, or, or, or later uh, grow uh, vegetables, um, farming. Uh, but this used to cost a lot more energy per day for every human. On average, actually 90% were farmers. Uh, uh, or before that, 100% uh, were hunters. Um, and gatherers and um, so it took many hours per day a uh, half a day or maybe sometimes the full day to just have enough food for the day whereas today uh, even if you are um, not making any money you're not doing any work uh, you're just begging for some money well you will get five euro or five dollars per day or ten dollars per day and and that will give you enough food for the day. Uh, just in, in a regular shop, you can buy enough um, basic uh, food for that. Um, but let's say you only have to work half an hour per day uh, to, uh, to have your food needs met. And, um, but for example, today we are still working a lot just to pay for our home. Uh, homes, real estate costs a lot of money. Uh, and so does um, cars and um, uh, I think a lot of this uh, will also improve over time um, as we become better in, in, uh, in producing these things. Uh, for example, homes are still produced uh, not really um, the way food is produced. It's still quite um, uh, labor intensive work uh, and um, hopefully uh, we will get uh, some great innovations there uh, so that uh, it be can become a lot cheaper uh, and you have to work a lot less to just have your uh, 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 roof over your head. Um, um, and of course taxation over time also goes down. Huh? Uh, you have uh, um, yeah, the society structure is that um, uh, yeah, uh, a lot of the labor uh, from all, goes to the political class uh, and, and the people that work for them and uh, this also is a, a big uh, drain but it does go down over time uh, as 
also the political class becomes more efficient uh, in uh, doing what they need to do at a cheaper price um, uh, teaming up in uh, larger uh, entities um, just like uh, it works in the regular economy too uh, the reason why things become cheaper is become it's because it's produced on a larger scale um, so uh, you see this that the world is evolving uh, that way but it's not always in a straight line up sometimes you have uh, fallbacks like for example communism uh, was um, was a, a fallback to a, a, a much larger uh, state uh, government than uh, before uh, communist came but you had a lot of also technological advances that um, even though you had a much uh, higher tax rate um, you did have gains in productivity but it was much lower than uh, capitalist capitalism where you had still a, a much smaller government but you had also these productivity increases and actually a lot more of them uh, so um, over time yeah communism has fallen you do have a lot of socialism uh, still going on and um, I hope that also that will go down over time that uh, the amount of taxes taken goes down you see this with money too um, that the inflation rate is going down over time at least since the 70s uh, and the, and in the 70s it actually had gone up a lot so that was a fall, fall back from the period before where also taxation was uh, sorry inflation was low um, when there was a gold standard so uh, but you see this also in uh, just education and how people raise their children that over time it becomes better whereas hundred actually not so you know, 50 years ago it was still normal to beat your children uh, when they didn't listen um, this becomes less acceptable though it is still accepted today but for example beating your wife at least in the west is not accepted anymore but 100 years ago this was accepted eh? or slavery was still okay 200 years ago uh, whereas today it's not anymore at all um, so um, that's great to see uh, that, that people raise their children better over time give them more love less abuse um, and um, I love to also see that in my life that I am improving things uh, compared to before for example how, how I was raised I want to give a much better uh, much more loving um, environment to my children um, of course you have evil people in the world um, people that do atrocities that uh, kill people or murder people uh, mass murder also happens uh, you have scammers liars um, you have bad people um, but on average these things um, you have less of them percentage wise today than you had uh, before um, so that's really what I love uh, about uh, humanity because I mean it's also what makes humans special I think um, that we are evolving that we are growing uh, in just population but also in what we are able to do um, uh, I think this is amazing and that's why I also uh, why I love to be part of that fight because this is not a given societies can crumble humanity can crumble uh, and instead of go up 
uh, go down again uh, in population or in in um, amount of wealth uh, we have uh, this all depends on our thinking if we think right uh, we will grow if we think wrong we will shrink um, um, so for example energy uh, is something very important um, cheap energy is something very important uh, and you can um, fuck that up uh, by um, making it illegal uh, for example nuclear energy this is controversial but it is my opinion that this is a very important and, and, and a very has been a very big step for humanity uh, the invention of nuclear energy and um, today we see a fallback where uh, in, in the West at least where this is uh, becomes verboten uh, or is highly regulated and um, and instead other much less efficient energy is being subsidized so money is taken and then given to that sector and and and, and so we get energy more expensively today than we did 20 30 years ago this is really not a good thing this is going back in time and it's due to poor thinking and believing th uh, things that are incorrect like that nuclear energy would not be environmental or would not be safe and uh, this is not true uh, it is um uh, it is much more environmental than the energy sources we had before that or we, that we are trying to use instead um, solar panels wind energy this is very primitive technology uh, to to try to get energy from that it is the, the, it's just much more expensive energy and um, um, just to maintain these installations and, and, and it's just much more costly people always are afraid about nuclear energy catastrophes uh, that's a risk um, but this is uh, can be easily uh, contained and managed uh, not by politicians a <laughs> free market is very important um, if you let politicians run a company of course it will go broke or it will have high uh, risk uh, of exploding uh, but um, um, it's like with the roads yeah you let politicians organize the roads it doesn't matter how much money you let them throw at it you will have traffic jams eh? because it's not a free market enterprise a free market enterprise will immediately solve traffic jams by raising prices building more uh, uh, roads but when it comes to politicians they they, they do the inverse they uh, they uh, they don't solve problems politicians should just limit their functions to um, what they do well uh, and uh, just um, not do things that companies can do uh, much better um, and of course it's also applicable to energy um, that's a problem uh, that, that certain things are going backwards and uh, Peter Till addresses this very well for example transportation uh, yeah, it used to be faster to travel with the car um, 20 30 years ago and then today or to travel with the plane eh? that's eh? and things can certainly go backwards uh, so we have to be very careful for that um, but overall uh, even when it's going backwards people realize it and always the first step is that people complain about these things and that's a good thing uh, that's how things change by addressing it um, and and that starts by complaining about it uh, talking about it that's why i like also to see on uh, facebook on the internet a lot of uh, these uh, police aggression uh, videos that are shared because this is the first step uh, to get improvement uh, is that the people are uh, starting to complain about this and share these things um so 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 yeah um I love life. I think it's a, it's a, it's a very um, amazing just that we live and that we cannot really understand uh, what's around us 
if you look at the universe, how big that is, it's bigger than we can grasp. And, uh, and, 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 um, I really hope that, uh, uh I really love also just the, 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 the laws of the universe uh, that you, if you study history, that those that, 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 um, that, uh, um, that just that personal interest, the more people can, that can follow their personal interests, the happier they are and the more um, they grow. Um, and um, I think it's just beautiful. Uh, so yeah, that was just a short video and um, I wish you all a great day. Bye.